Good day YouTube. This video will show you guys how to install the XFCE desktop environment in Linux Mint 17.3. Now just a bit of a background on XFCE. It's designed to be uh, more lightweight, more uh, this is all fairly visually appealing and just fairly stable as well. Just a bit of an alternative to say Cinnamon, the Cinnamon desktop environment for example, which is uh, native to Linux Mint. Now um, I don't see necessarily why one would really want to change between Cinnamon and uh, to XFCE because Cinnamon is still quite lightweight as it is, uh, much more lightweight than the Unity in Ubuntu, but I've used it once or twice, it's pretty cool to use and uh, if you really feel you want to switch over, these are the steps to do it. So starting off, a uh, fairly simple process, just uh, jump across to a terminal, hit Control alt t or click on the terminal icon, then type in the following which is sudo apt install xfce4 hit enter throw in your password and uh, let that do its business there so what have we got uh yep yeah, six or seven meg to download so it might take longer than the video i might pause the video we'll see but uh oh no that's going pretty quickly so uh, one thing of course to mention is you do want to back up all your stuff before you do make this change. Uh, so it won't actually delete the Cinnamon desktop, it will just uh, install the XFCE desktop of course and you can switch between which desktop environment you use when you actually load up the machine and go to the login screen you'll get an option to change. So we'll see uh, how long this takes. maybe taking a bit too long but just a word of advice or warning a little bit of a disclaimer always back up your stuff before you do something like this now I've uh, I must have done this hundreds of times in the past honestly but uh, I've never actually had a problem with uh, installing XFCE sometimes KDE causes a few issues which you really need to back up but either way just back up back up back up as I like to say and what I'll do is I'll just pause the video and then I'll come back when it's done Okay guys, so we are done. Now the next step will be to log out, then log back in, so that we can select the new XFCE desktop environment. So let's give that a go. Let's go to the start menu. Go to, oh, no, we wanna, we wanna log out. We won't have to shut down, you can if you like though. Here we go, log out. Give that just a hot second. And in just a second, we'll see the option to switch between the desktop environments. Okay, so the little gear icon it should be. And we have, so currently on Cinnamon, but move to XF or XFCE session. Click there, check in your password, click OK. Oh, no. <laughs> Let me try that again. Uh, Username, password, and let's load in. Ah, oh, okay, welcome to the first other panel. Choose uh, use default. Okay, I'm going to just go use default. There we go, good, and great. And there we have it. Okay, we've got our applications up here, all of that. Not so much review, just to show you guys. A little bit more uh, what you might call lightweight. That sort of thing but uh, yeah that's pretty much it guys in a nutshell uh, install switch on and use all right thanks guys hope you've enjoyed